Okay, welcome to the official start of WA vlog. I'm not sure how much I'll put in this vlog. Probably like Argyle, El Cuestro, probably all the way from Kananara to Broome will go in this vlog, which is a big distance. It's like over a thousand Ks, but unfortunately we can't get to that many places because we don't have a four wheel drive, but nevertheless, this is the start of the vlog. We have just arrived at Lake Argyle. Um, I didn't vlog the very start and coming through the border, but we have a story time. Basically, when we drove from Catherine into WA, this is a whole nother story, but I had a flat tire, we changed it. I'm gonna do a whole story time on that. But when we entered the border, because we originally had planned to stop in at Keep National Park, which is in the Northern Territory, still had a lot of like fresh produce. And then when we entered the WA border, I beforehand told Cassandra that I'd like to eat a pear, apple or orange or something. Cause we saw online that when you get pulled over at the border, they like take all your fresh produce cause of the soil or like something like that. One of the rules. Benji blamed me. I wanted to eat something. But I didn't think it'd be a problem cause it was so late because we were mucking around with the tire and everything. Anyway, we had to declare all our food, which it was all gone. Was so Even the sad. honey. <laughs> But yeah, that was the experience entering the border. Then in Kananara, we were there for a day or two fixing, getting a new tire and doing all that. And finally, we're at Lake Argyle. There's a pretty infamous infinity pool here that like every influencer takes a photo at. So I guess we gotta do it. Influencer things. Oh my God, can't wait. But all Benji's excited, the only thing Benji's excited for is there's a, a beer garden and they play the footy tonight, so. And the hot chicks, there's some hot. But yeah, let's go WA. Woo! So the campsite here is really expensive. It's $54 for one night of an unpowered site, which is absolutely ridiculous, but we've just booked it in for one night. Kind of got to do it once. We free camp everywhere, so sometimes you just got to splurge out. Pretty gross, if we're honest. Pool review. What do we think of the pool? Pool. Overall, three out of ten. Definitely one of those places that you see on like Instagram that everyone goes to, and then when you go to it, it's kind of it's shit. just yeah, it's just right. a like overpriced caravan place. The lake is really and the view is really beautiful, but the pool is actually like gross. There's so many bugs in it, and it's super packed, but. Do it for the gram, I guess. But the cool thing about the pool is Harry Potter is actually here. I don't know if you've noticed, but it's we've got a wizard. We've got a wizard with us. Belly armor, Patronus. So we've just started a 2.5 kilometer each way walk to just a lookout called the Bluff Lookout. Um, this is the current view, very, very pretty. But we originally planned to do this for sunrise, but we had too many beers last night watching the footy and we slept in. So now it's like 30 degrees and it's 9 a.m. bricks and it's so cool impressed he's not impressed but i am
because the track's like unmarked, it's very overgrown and the plants are really spiky on your legs. And Benji's kind of struggling with it. But it's worth it. Okay, so we finished up at Lake Argyle. We're just um, fresh and clean now. We had another shower. Yeah, just gonna have a bit of a lazy afternoon. I'm really excited for tomorrow. I was planning, using the reception here and planning what we can get to in El Cuestro. El Cuestro, El Cuestro. In the meantime, let's drive. Insert drone shots. Good morning. Can you tell which one of us had a good sleep and which one of us didn't sleep till 12? Ding, ding, ding. Benji's grumpy this morning. managed to bring the van all the way to ZB, ZBD, Zebedee? ZBD. Zebedee Springs. We get to the hot springs and how warm are they? They're like 28 to 32 degrees all year round. And it's so nice. What do you rate it out of 10? Uh, 8.65. I give it at least a 9.5. These are so beautiful. Saying goodbye to the van, we've come back to Amelia Falls to do the walk. I think it's only three point, what did I say before? 3.6 return? 3.5. Oh, I got that. Benji tripped. How was it? Where'd you go? Did you have a good trip? Yeah. Oh yeah, you got a black bite and snake.
got back to the van, very, very hot. Benji's struggling, a bit dehydrated. I'm so red and we're gonna head to Emma Gorge. <laughs> trip days we have finally arrived in the beautiful beautiful broom benji carried it home today did the last four hours and i did most of it yesterday <laughs> Simpsons Beach this morning, which is a very Instagram worthy beach. Um, I've just flown the drone, so I'll show you the footage. Jump scare warning. I warned ya. This is what I look like when I edit, if you've ever wondered. Um, but yeah, I was editing the vlog and I didn't really take much content of when we were in Broome. So basically Benji has left now, but he was with me for about five or six days in Broome and I didn't really pull the camera out too much. I was just kind of enjoying the moment and just like forgot to vlog. So, yeah, I've made like a little montage of what we got up to and like how beautiful Broom is, but this is what we're working with. Back to editing. And that is the end of the vlog. Thank you for watching. If you've stuck around for the very end, I am now solo again by myself. So I've just kind of been adjusting to being alone again. And next I'm heading off to Karajini National Park, which is probably one of the most anticipated national parks yet. It's so beautiful. It's gonna be one of my favorites. So keep an eye out for that. And thanks for watching. Bye, broom.